So let's talk about how this event is actually going to go down. They have three lifts. Last night, they had to pick their opening lift, and we will go from lightest to heaviest as the man from Slovenia, Matjaj Belšak, gets set for his first lift, 796 pounds on that rogue elephant bar. Yes, I don't know if he's had a chance to train on a bar that's this, that's this uh, flexible. As we said, you've got to pull the bar, be patient from the bottom, pushing your feet down and really getting to where you get to your knees and then you can pull back on the bar some. But it also wants to pull you forward. That flex actually works to pull you forward. Using the straps, the strap is a very different lift in some ways than the unstrapped deadlift. You're gonna see the athlete get his hips down. Belshak has a minute to make his attempt. 796 pounds, and that will be no problem, and Belshak's first attempt is good. 796 for Matus Kaleshkowski. You don't see very many guys use the sumo style. Let him hear it, 800 pounds! 796 looks great for Kaleshkowski as his first lift is successful. 802 for Alexei Novikov. Here we go. Pardon me, 820. 820 is good for the youngster. Yes, and we have gone three for three so far. And he is stepping up to 900, four pounds, so making a big jump from Alexei Novikov's 820. He's in the thousand-pound club. Also wearing socks. And Carone drops 904, maybe grabs his right hamstring there. First attempt to Ron Ohinla. And that will count, will get the weight on the bar for you, but the most important, important thing for Heinla is that his first attempt is good. You don't see a lot of guys wearing mouthpiece. Here's Martins Lisi's. With his first attempt, he won the Arnold Classic Europe competition, also won the Arnold Classic USA competition that was held a couple months ago in Santa Monica, right there on the pier. 420 kilos for Lisi's. And that is no problem. 950 pounds for his first attempt. 431 kilos. This is quite a start for him. But we've seen in the past, he has a heart of a lion. A winner of the Zukov medal. Let's see the effort on the ship, Lyakov. No problem for Shivlikov. 950 in the books for him in his opening lift. 950 pounds for Brian Shaw. Rattling that ball on. And that goes up easily. Very easily done. He also has those very wide foot stances, just like Brian Shaw does. Two of the taller athletes with similar setups. Half Thor Bjornsson, attempt number one, 955 pounds. Gravity is not a problem for that man with 955 pounds, and that goes up just like Brian Shaw's opening list lift. So now the battle has started, regardless of the weight on the bar. He has the same form all the time. This is his opening attempt at 974 pounds. You guys can help him get this weight up. Putting his straps on, he too uses a wide foot placement. He pulls a little bit like Andy Bolton, if I would encourage you to. Look at look at the Andy Bolton style, where he uses he uses the his lever of his hips and his back. Pritchett right to work, and 974 goes up. Okay, this is round two. Matthews Kaleshkowski opening up with 829 pounds.
Great lift for Kayla Skoski. Novikov certainly has the most colorful sock choice of any of the athletes. It helped him with his first attempt at 820, and now 20-pound leap to 840 pounds is second of three lifts. Novikov will get the lift. So two for two for the youngster from Ukraine. Here's Matyash Belshak out of Slovenia. Matyash 860 pounds. Matyash told me he was born strong. Grew up in a family of cooking enthusiasts. And his parents own a restaurant in Slovenia where he sometimes works as an apprentice chef and probably hauls a lot of big objects around that restaurant. That's 860 that goes up easily. 950 pounds for his second of three attempts. I love the way he solidly locks his hips in before he starts. 951. Ron O'Heinla hits 950 pounds. Here's Martinez Lisi's, his second attempt, 970 pounds, four pounds less than Pritchett lifted in round one. And 970 is good for the Dragon. That is a personal best for him. This lift to tie Jerry Pritchett for the lead at 974 pounds. And Shivlikov with the blood running from his nose. That is common for him. He has that problem a lot. He is okay, but that lift will count. 974 pounds. Shaw locked in and ready to go. 1,021 pounds on the bar. Brian Shaw stands up 1,021 pounds, and that is a personal best for him on the elephant bar. And here we go, Bill. Here comes Pritchett approaching the elephant bar, 1,030 pounds. And look at all the cameras coming out in the crowd. This is a big moment here early in this competition. Not using a really long strap. Getting right to work, and Pritchett oh. comes up limping. So 1,030 does not go up for Jerry Pritchett. 1,045 pounds, and a new elephant bar world record at stake right now for the man they call the mountain, Half Thor Bjornsson. In only the second round, he has one lift remaining after this. Wow. Give me a break. How easy is that? And a new world record, 1,045 pounds for the mountain. 871 pounds on the bar for Kalish Koski. This would be a best lift for him. Remember, folks, your energy makes that bar move for these athletes. Kalish Koski. And Kalish Koski will get it. Now, although he is not in contention for the win in this event, that has got to be a big confidence builder for this kid. Absolutely. It's another step forward. Alexi Novikov, 884 pounds. And 
just cannot get it to his knees and then overcome the weight. And he will bow out, but a good opening performance for the rookie, Alexei Novikov. Here's 891 for Belshock. And that will count. And not Josh Belshock out of Slovenia. Perfect three for three in the elephant bar deadlift. Heinlein won't get it to go. Thanks to crowd. And he will go two for three. 1,001 pounds. Looking to become the sixth man to lift four digits. And Lisi's will not get it to go, and the club stays at five members. He will continue to pull, but there's nothing left. And Shivlikov cannot get 1,005 to go. The Siberian force thanking the crowd. Will we see another record? 1,045 pounds for Brian Shaw. Getting himself, getting himself set up. He's had all year to think about last year when he had a, a chance for the third deadlift to take the lead. Here we go. And Shaw falling forward over the bar on that attempt. It will not go for him. And that means that Hathor Bjornsson is the winner of this event with one lift remaining. Hafthor Bjornsson staring at history and 1,105 pounds getting the crowd behind him as he lines up for his third and final attempt. $50,000 on the line here for Hafthor Bjornsson. For all the marbles, here it is. At the knees, and Bjornsson oh. cannot get it. Bjornsson wins the event, 1,045 pounds, and a new Elephant Bar world record. Brian Shaw will finish second. Jerry Pritchett, despite the fact that he didn't make a third lift, will tie for third with Mikhail Shivlikov, Martins Lisis, rounding out the top five.